Welcome to the Fabrengen on the Sicha. This is the Sicha of Yutes Kislev that compares the story of the Alter Rebbe on a spiritual sense with Yaakov Avinu and the small jugs, the empty jugs, the Pachim Ketanim. What's fascinating is that Yaakov Avinu goes into a war with the Sar Shal Esav, with the angel of Esav over Pachim Ketanim. And the Rebbe brings that around to a fascinating idea. That the Alter Rebbe similarly went into war, was put in jail so that the Kavonas Habria, the Pachim Ketanim, can be achieved. When I was a kid, when somebody called me a Pusta Kela, or a Pusta Vusta Kela, a totally empty vessel, they weren't wrong. But what they didn't also appreciate is that the Alter Rebbe went on Mesiris Nefesh, that this Pusta Kela will become not just a keli to carry fresh water from a Mayon somewhere, the bottled water. Bottled water is what anyone who does outreach can do. Hafotzas HaMayonos becoming the spring, the well itself, is when a pusta kela is the spring. Now to do that, the Alter Rebbe had to synthesize the spiritual and the material worlds. It wasn't good enough the way it was that great tzaddikim and tzaddikim nistarim and the 36 hidden tzaddikim according to those who wish to get into that stuff should do their magic and therefore thereby lift us up. But what the Alter Rebbe, through revealing Chassidus in the way he did, wanted that you should know you're a Pustakela, but you could also be a Mayon. And that is not saying to yourself, Oh, look at me, I am Mr. Mayono, is Chutzah himself. No, 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 no. We need to know and have the humility to know where a Pustakela. And the magic, the magic of Chassidus is that a Pustakela can also be a Mayon. And this is because Yaakov Avinu and the Alter Rebbe did their avoid it to prepare us so that we can pull off this amazing miracle. So go out there and do your magic.